Could we see another province wide shutdown as COVID-19 numbers continue to hover around the 400 mark? Well, medical professionals across the province have come together and they're urging the Ford government to consider another shutdown before things get out of control. A call to roll things back after cases in the province have been overall in an upward trend over the last two weeks, with some days over 400. That growth in cases is real. It's not just a function of increased testing, but it's also a function of increased community transmission. This prompting the Ontario Hospital Association on behalf of 38 healthcare professionals to send out a statement calling on the Ford government to tighten restrictions on all non-essential businesses. That would include gyms, bars and restaurants. If we can't uh, keep our rates of community transmission low, uh, that really puts at substantial risk the ability to keep schools open and it also puts at risk the safety of other settings like long-term care facilities, uh, group homes, shelters, etc. The Ford government has said they want to avoid a full shutdown as long as possible to not hurt the economy. Restaurants Canada has also come out to say more restrictions will devastate their industry. A second shutdown would be dire. It would, uh, it would be uh, catastrophic for the industry. Um, there's a lot of people that are just hanging on by a thread. Restaurants Canada says about 10% of establishments went out of business due to COVID-19 so far. And while we see case numbers slowly creeping up, those in the hospitality industry argue getting together for a dinner at a restaurant is a safe option. If you want to socialize with a few friends that are in your bubble, a restaurant's an excellent opportunity to do that. Uh, don't have a backyard barbecue, don't have a party. Go somewhere that uh, someone is looking after your safety. With the numbers that we're having right now and the difficulty that we're experiencing around turnaround times, for example, and the ability of public health to contact all necessary potential contacts of cases, it makes it very difficult for us to get this under control right now. The Ontario Hospital Association says with tighter restrictions, we could ensure that schools remain open. They say they'd like to also see more restrictions around more densely populated areas. Melissa Nakavali, City News.